It's the first Tom Reagan Memorial Lecture, so we're really pleased to honor Tom's memory, the fact that it came together here at NC State, where he taught, obviously, for many, many decades. The Culture and Animals Foundation, which was co-founded by Tom and Nancy Reagan back in 1986, and I am thrilled to be here at the inaugural Tom Reagan Memorial Lecture and to listen to our speaker, Carol J. Adams, who is a phenomenally interesting theorist and feminist social critic and critical theorist. I think it's incredible to have a memorial lecture so that we can lift up what Tom has done, reflect on it, and continue to help shape new animal rights theory, new animal rights activism. To always remember that Tom was both an activist and a theorist, and he saw these as compatible and enriching each other. I'm excited because Carol Adams, the speaker, is the first recipient of a grant from the Culture and Animals Foundation. And it's, it's very apposite that all these issues are coming together today for this special event. Animal Ethics finds itself participating in the contested area of lack by asking the opposite. How are animals like us? And we thought having Carol Adams, who's such an important, but also really an alive a thinker and also activist, as the first um, lecturer would be really terrific. What animal means and what it means to be an animal is a constructed status that appears permanent, allowing animality to de facto justify oppression. I think more people need to educate themselves on topics like this and the stigma surrounding uh, social science research needs to uh, end because these are really important topics that are being discussed. It was a really fascinating, compelling talk and uh, a lot of vision, ideas and breadth and a lot to, to digest and think about. I love how she makes sure that we understand that what we eat affects how the world sees racism, sexism, cruelty to animals, and the environment. We can really make a huge difference, and she helps make it happen. So thank you, Culture and Animals Foundation, for your support and for honoring me with this invitation.